from violating women's rights and restricting their freedom to banning modern education in schools and universities taliban is delivering exactly what the world feared despite promises to the contrary the terror organization turned government in afghanistan are continuing with their often bizarre dictates after women now the new rulers of afghanistan have turned their eyes on to men and what they wear the latest target of taliban's new dress code are neckties in their contempt for western clothing taliban has expressed apprehension over neckties worn by men While talking to the media, head of the Invitation and Guidance Directorate, Mohammad Hashim Shahid Ro said that neckties resemble the Christian cross. The Invitation and Guidance Directorate is the department that seeks to guide people along proper Islamic lines in Afghanistan. Ro expressed his dissent after seeing Afghan Muslim men wearing ties during his visit to hospital and other areas. He said that the symbolism of the tie is obvious in Islam and was quoted saying What is a tie? It is a cross. It is ordered in Sharia that you should break it and eliminate it. Ever since the Taliban came to power in August 2021, its main aim was to eradicate western culture from the country. Westernized clothing has been completely shunned in the region over fears of Taliban reprisal. Women were the worst to suffer under the brutal and patriarchal Taliban regime. Taliban ordered women to cover up with a hijab when out in public. The dress rule was also compulsory for female students, teachers, and staff in the country. Although the militant organization hasn't imposed any dress rules for men, they have been cracking down on those who are seen wearing western dresses like jeans that deviate from traditional Afghan clothing.